I have this really cool couch cover right here. Now I'm in my kid's playroom. This couch gets used and abused all the time. They're jumping on and all that. And if I want to keep it clean, it's really nice to be able to have this couch cover. Now, couch is already in decent condition, but if you had a couch that's maybe not, having this couch cover just makes it look brand new really, really quick. There's a couple ways to go about it. You can put the whole thing over your entire couch, ready to rock and roll. But the way that we're going to do it is we're going to take the cushions off, put the cover on, and then we have individual covers that we're going to put on the cushions themselves, make it look really nice. So to start that out, I'm going to take the cushions off and we are going to put this cover on. You can do this with one person as you're going to see just me doing it, but it's way, way easier if you have it with two people. So I would highly recommend when you're doing it, if you have a second, you can just make it go a lot quicker, but really in the end, you can totally do this with one. So there's a couple spots that you're going to want to know to be able to make sure that it's lined up right, which is one, the armrest itself. So you got the armrest lined up and you can see that with the stitching with how it works. So we're also going to come over here to the other side. Make sure that the stitching is lined up when it comes to the armrest because that's kind of one really good starting point. Right here, you can see the stitching. So if you get that stitching all lined up, it will work out really well. It's kind of this thing is super comfortable. The material, very, very comfortable. It's kind of it has like that cooling effect. It feels your couch in the back showing. You could have it nice and covered in the back. Now, I'm just putting this on real quick, but it also has an attachment if you want to be able to really cinch it down so that this is not showing, so it's a little bit more snug on the bottom. We're just doing this real quick, throwing it together, showing you. Make sure that that's all good. It does look nice. But we're going to make it even look better when we put these cushions on the actual, sorry, like the covers on the actual cushions themselves. Oh, let me pull this top over. Got some extra slack. Once again, crazy stretchy. And then all the way to the bottom. Okay, we're going to do the cushions now, and then I'll really hone this in. Cushions, look how small this thing is, and look how big that cushion is. And it's going to fit, which is amazing. So get that lined up. Gonna get it started, kind of just doing this. Once again, it has these seams where you can see that it should obviously go on the crease itself. And then do that. You're gonna pull this thing all the way up. And make sure that it's covering every aspect. How stretchy this is, it's surprising. So that it looks really nice. You have it nice and taut, it looks a lot better than when it's all like snaggy and slacky. But this looks really good so there's one just throw that on and I'll pull that down and then we got the other one right here sorry guys there we go and i'm gonna put this one on same exact way i like to find the two creases grab it with my hands pull it over make sure that the seams line up where they should because if you get the seams to line up you can really just stretch the thing however you want and it's going to work out. But if you don't have the seams lined up, it's going to be all funky. You don't really know which way it should go on. So make sure to get those seams where they should be. Just these right here on the edge. And you kind of pull everything nice and tight to get it taut all around. Just like this. And add this in together. This is where if you took a little bit more time and to be able to really pull everything in, get all that slack out, this would look brand new, which it already, I think, does. And I'm going really quick at this, as you can see. You can go take your time a little bit more, but look at this. Look how good this looks, and really quick. So yeah, I haven't pulled all this slack out. It also has these bungee cords at the bottom, like this. Let me show you. Right. Oh, sorry, it's on the back side. I grab it, and you can attach it on the back so that it pulls like this. So if you have all this slack, you can easily grab that other... Uh, bungee cord that was on the side on the back you pull it under snap it snap it into place so that it pulls all the way at the bottom so that this would look like that which is really nice but other than that now you got your couch you can relax i'm breathing because i was going really quick but you can make this look amazing it is so soft so comfortable so i hope you guys like it because this is great this one even came with a third cushion there are or sorry like a third cover there are so many different uh designs that they have for different sizes of couches. You can make this work in so many different ways. So hope you like it. Have a good one, guys.